Right, hello social media. This is going to be a very short video. I've been researching um, what's called pandemic bonds and what they actually are. Yeah, I know, pandemic bonds. So basically in 2017, the World Bank and the World Health Organization got together and decided to issue pandemic bonds that have um, an 11% a year payout. Now, they're supposedly to fund poor countries should a uh, pandemic occur and they are modelled on the event of a coronavirus outbreak in China. I know you can't make this stuff up. You know, a new bond that's modelled on something that occurs. Yeah, right, okay. So they have been criticised um, in that the criteria to receive the money means that there has to be a pandemic for 12 weeks before any money is paid out and there has to be um, if there's more than eight countries to get uh, more money but anyway it's um, the countries that basically get paid out are the countries in, who come under the International Devel Development um, Agency and as it stands at the moment there are only two in that country in sorry in that organization both linked to China by the way um, they are Nepal and Cambodia. But while I was researching that, I've come across something that it's quite disturbing that I thought I need to share with you, sort of ASA. Okay. So the same um, insurance company that were um, behind this pandemic bond in 2017... So this insurance company is called Swiss Ray and Matter, Matterhorn Ray, uh, the same company that were involved in the Grenfell Tower insurance claims. So these uh, insurance company, in companies have placed a 255 million catastrophe bond in February of 2020, and it's from February 2020 to to. 2022 so it's for two years and what what it states is really unbelievable it states one is a u.s one's for a u.s named storm and the other is extreme mortality events in the uk canada and australia yeah. so the UK is going to be holding the 33rd Vaccination and Immunisation International Meeting um, March 16th to the 17th, so we've got two 33s there. And Garve are also on a fundraiser this year to collect money uh, from donors to implement a vaccination drive. So for goodness sake, folks, don't take them vaccines, okay? Stay safe. I'm only logical. See you later.